what is up you guys it's Katya books welcome back to my channel and welcome to another supplement review yes oh my gosh these are some of my video favorite videos to film for sure and I'm hoping you guys enjoy them just as much as I enjoy making them and pretty cool review to do today because I've been wanting to try this for a while and have had it on my hands for a while but I just thought I made the video so you saw from the title and the thumbnail. We are reviewing the BPN, Bear Performance Nutrition Vegan Protein Powder. So they have two flavors, which is chalk or R, chocolate and peanut butter cookie. Oh, so excited for the peanut butter cookie because you know your girl loves her peanut butter. So yeah, no vanilla, which is totally fine because it's hard to find a good vanilla out there other than Sun Warrior. So I'm super stoked to try these and because, I mean, who doesn't love peanut butter? So jumping straight into it, let's see what we've got here. When it comes to macros, they both are the same. 130 calories, 3.5 fat, 3 carb, and 22 protein. And so it looks like it's just a pea protein for this one a there's a some peanut flour watermelon seed protein pumpkin seed protein so a fair blend it doesn't look like they they also have it says a digestive enzyme blend which is amylase and yada yada don't need to go into the details of that but it's not anything like you know a whole fruits and veg blend not quite like live body where they have like probiotics and everything in it but I like that it has the digestives enzymes in it just to help you digest it better with really good macros so pretty stoked to try it really good protein whether it be for you know midday or post workout nutrition so let's just get straight into trying this I mean I'm too excited not to try this right now because peanut butter cookie so but I want to start actually with the chocolates because I also very much like chocolate. So I'm gonna pop these open and then put them in a cup of water and we'll try it together. So let me tell you, it smelled really good when I opened up the tub. It's kind of funny because for the scoop size, it says like about 31.2 grams. So I thought that was just kind of interesting that they did that instead of saying like 35 grams or whatever. Um, but anyways, yeah, it nice chocolatey color. Like I said, smelled so good, just the powder. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, that smells really, really nice. Mm. All right, taste test. Mmm. That's so good. Oh man, that reminds me of just having like a cold chocolate milk instead of like a hot chocolate. It's not, yeah, it doesn't taste as much as hot chocolate as it does more having cold chocolate milk, if you know what I mean. Remember being like a kid, and you know, just with milk and Hershey syrup. That kind of reminds me of what this is. So it's a nice, rich, chocolatey flavor. I will say when I bought these, I couldn't find any kind of coupon codes, but compared to like the price and the taste, I think it's well worth the price. I'll double check the price at the end to let you guys know, but otherwise like, mm, definitely a top contender for like one of my favorite chocolate protein powders. I mean, I think the German chocolate cake by Live Body might be like my favorite, if not, you know, Sun Warriors chocolate protein powder. But this is, this is up there. Like I would say like an 8.5 out of 10. Tiny bit of texture, not quite as smooth as Live Body. I will say that, I mean, you can see kind of the texture around the glass that it's holding on to. But other than that, I mean, the taste is really good. So just with water, you do get a bit of the texture. I'm sure if you put it in a smoothie, it's gonna be quite smooth. But otherwise, yeah, I really like it. Okay, I'm gonna finish this, clean out the cup, and then we're gonna try peanut butter cookie. Yes. All right, so onto the peanut butter cookie, which oh, so excited for, like, mm, can't even imagine. Oh, that smells pretty darn good. A very light peanut buttery flavor, or I mean, smell to it. Mmm. That's really good. Wow, they did a really freaking good job with a peanut butter flavor. I think the only other one that I really liked was the steel protein peanut butter. That one was so good. Then again, all of their flavors were really, really good. So this is, wow. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. I'm amazed. I'm amazed because the worst one I've ever had was it was the Redcon One protein. They had other good flavors, but their peanut butter barely came through. Still fairly light. I don't know if it's just the ratio of the water to how much I put in here. But from what I can tell, this one's also even a little bit smoother than the chocolate for some reason. Like the, the little bit of grit that I was getting in the other one, not as much, like kind of there, but just so faint that it's much easier that I don't think people would really complain about it if they're gonna just drink it with water because it tastes pretty freaking good. I'll give it like a nine out of 10. Mm. Okay, yeah, okay. Oof. Definitely like this more than the chocolate. That is for sure. So I'm gonna finish this up, clean up my mess that I made around here, and then we are gonna wrap up this video to give you my final thoughts of this protein to see if it is Katia Bulk's approved. All right. All right, you guys, so it's time to wrap up this video and let you know my final thoughts on the Bear Performance Vegan Proteins. So yes, oh my goodness, they were delicious. Like I gave this one an 8.5 out of 10, and this one like a nine out of 10, but overall worth getting, I wanna say more so closer to seven out of 10, just because of the fact that I saw that it was strictly just a pea protein blend. And so there's not like the balance of pea protein and brown rice protein to give you a full amino profile. And so because it doesn't reflect the full amino profile, I can't say for sure it's gonna give you everything you need for that proper muscle recovery post-workout. So if you do want to try it because you're just too excited for the flavor, I would say combine this with like a brown rice protein or just consume some brown rice just so you get that full amino profile. Otherwise, if you want like a protein that gives you all of that in one, I would say go for like the live body protein. I've got a link in the description box below. below. Um, but if you wanna try this, I'll also link their website if you wanna go ahead and try it because the peanut butter cookie is so, so good. I am just gonna have to like combine it with something else post-workout just to ensure that I'm giving my muscles all the essential aminos it needs to build and get strong. So yes, if you did enjoy this review, do give it a nice big thumbs up and if you haven't already subscribe and let me know in the comment section below what you'd like for me to review next i think i have a pre-workout for you guys next so stay tuned for that otherwise go get your protein go get your games and yeah i'll see you in the next video bye